Hello, I'm Paul Wilson. One of the more common administration tasks we have to carry out on a day-to-day -day basis is to configure and enable users' call forwarding. To do this, log into the System Administration tool Go to Users and Devices, Advanced Configuration, and choose Call Forwarding Profile. From here we can configure any user on the system, call forward destinations and enable and disable the feature. In this example we'll add a call forwarding profile for extension 1111 and forward that extension's calls to an external number. Click Add. Enter the extension number, double one, double one. Select the call forward type, always forwards all calls to that extension. Busy internal and busy external, forward calls when the user is already on a call. And no answer internal and external, or forward calls if the user doesn't answer the call within 15 seconds. We'll choose always. Enter the forward destination. If we're going to forward the calls to an internal number, simply enter the extension number. If we're going to forward calls to an external number, make sure to include the 9 at the beginning of the number for an outside line. And click Save. You may notice Call Forward Enable is switched to off by default. This means that when we dial extension double one double one, the call won't forward. It's usually up to the user to switch forwarding on and off from the super key or the application key on their own extension. We can enable it from here if need be though. Click change. Forwarding enabled. Set to on. And click save. Now any calls to extension double one double one will be forwarded to an external mobile phone number. Thank you.